In this video, we're going to talk about how to improve your readability score in WordPress. Welcome to All-in-One SEO. We make SEO easy with our powerful WordPress SEO plugin. So what is readability and why is it important? Well, readability, as the name implies, is how easy it is for people to read and understand the content of your website. And we measure readability with metrics like word choice, sentence length, and syllable count. Readability can seem like a subjective thing, but there are ways that we can quantify it. Things like sentence length, paragraph length, use of headings, use of images. And then we can take all of those things combined and come up with a readability score. There are nine basic components to a readability score and therefore nine things that you can work on to improve the readability of your web content. Number one, avoid using complex words. It can be very tempting when you're writing to use the full vocabulary you have at your disposal to show everyone how educated you are and that you are an authority on your subject. However, this can be a mistake because not everyone consuming your content has the same vocabulary. Number two, easy to understand and short sentences. People reading on the web have a much shorter attention span than people sitting down to read a book. So we want to use short, punchy sentences that are easy to understand. Number three, write shorter paragraphs. Again, people reading content on the web are not coming from the same mentality as people sitting down to read a book. They have very short attention spans and short paragraphs that flow from one to the other work a lot better than a long, intimidating block of text. Number four, add images and videos. If you have a lot to say with words, an image speaks a thousand words, so break up those big blocks of text with images and videos. Number five, divide your content with headings. It's well as being a good thing to do from an SEO perspective, it also makes your content much more readable if you break up your paragraphs with headings. Number six, check the use of passive voice. A lot of writers tend to write in the passive voice, but the active voice has much more clarity and is easier to understand. Number seven, use transitional words. Again, people reading content on the web have short attention spans and using words like however, because, therefore, can really help bring the reader from one paragraph of text to the next. Number eight, make your content conversational. If you can write from a conversational tone, you'll make your content that much more engaging. Number nine is the flesh reading test. This is a popular tool that helps writers analyze their content by giving it a score between zero and 100. The closer you get to 100, then the easier your content is to read. That's a lot. That's nine different things to go over. This is what I would call the hard way of making sure that your content is readable. The easy way is to use our all-in-one SEO plugin. Our plugin has a tool built in that analyzes the readability of your web content. It takes those nine steps that you would have to do manually and automates them. Let's get started. So from the WordPress dashboard, assuming you have the all-in-one SEO plugin installed, we're going to go ahead and go to any one of our posts or pages, or you could also create a new post or page and start writing your content. But I'm going to pull up one that I've had here. I'm going to go onto the post section and I'm going to pull up this post called configuring the schema settings in all in one SEO. And then if we scroll down past the content of the post to the AIO SEO section, here's the AIO SEO settings. And then below that we have a section called page analysis. And in page analysis, we have three different tabs, basic SEO, title, and readability. I'm going to click on the readability tab. So here we can see those items that we were talking about having to manually go through earlier. Here, our all-in-one SEO plugin has grouped them for you all in one place. So the first one, we're getting a check mark here. It's saying images and video and content. It's telling me your content contains images or videos. It's telling me the paragraph length is good. You are using short paragraphs. It's telling me the sentence length is good, and it's telling me that I'm using enough active voice. So you can click any of these little arrows to expand or collapse the details of each one of these items. Below that, we have transition words, and it's telling me that only 18% of the sentences contain transition words, which is not enough, and I need to use more of them. Under consecutive sentences, it's telling me that the text contains four consecutive sentences starting with the same word, and I need to try to mix things up. It's telling me my subheading distribution is good. Great job. And the flesh reading score, I'm getting a 73.9, which is considered easy to read. So as you can see, when we have our plugin installed, it actually does this readability analysis for you. It makes it very easy to see all the things that you can work on. 
So for this piece, if I was going to go work on the readability of it, I would make sure that I have more transition words, and I would look at these four sentences and see if I could start them a little differently. So that's how to improve your readability score in WordPress. If you click on this next video right here, we'll show you how to perform an SEO analysis on your website. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks on how to use our easy and powerful WordPress SEO plugin, All-in-One SEO.